Welcome back to DIY Area 2020. So, for our first DIY, we're gonna take a coil, put some ribbon on there, and secure it with hot glue. Then we're gonna take some Easter grass, fill it in, take a glittery egg. That is just an eggshell with glue and glitter on, actually. So, secure it in place where you wanna have it. Then take again some Easter grass, put a little chicken there, or I don't know, bunny, and we decided for putting around some chocolate eggs so it looks even more fabulous. There you go, first day white. Next one, we cut out two triangular shapes to create the ears of the bunny. Uh, the bunny is actually just a glittery toilet paper roll. Then we put on some wiggly eyes and draw a face with just a marker. Then we took a hot glue gun again and put some glue on the top of the roll. Then we took such of those glittery eggs again, secure it on there, put some Easter grass in there, some chocolate eggs, and some little chocolate bunny. There you go, second DIY. And it's super pretty. Just to give it to someone as a present. Wow, look at that. For the third one, we're gonna take some old socks. Cut out a triangular shape actually, um, fill it with some rice. So for the next step we took some pretty ribbon to secure the ears, so the top part. Next step is that you create, like from that sock, a little buddy and the head, just and secure it with some ribbon again on there. And for the last step, you're just gonna take a marker again and draw on a little face. And don't forget the lashes. Pretty Easter Bunny, made out of a sock. There is a second try, it's the same thing again, just that we didn't make a body and a hat, we just made a little hat, so it's a baby bunny. Draw on the face again, and you can create a whole bunny family out of that. For the next one, we're gonna need some paper bags. We normally take those for breakfast, but yeah, cut out a triangular shape to create the ears again. Draw on a little face, we just decided for drawing the mouth, nose, and some whiskers. Fill it up with candy, any as you want. Take a little ribbon again and secure it with a bow. Now it looks very minimalistic, so we decided for just putting on some glue to the ears and yeah, some glitter because glitter makes everything fabulous. Look at that! Wow! So that try wasn't perfect, so you will see another one right here. We took to the cotton swap and made a little tail. Okay, Coco. So for the next one, you're going to take an empty glass bottle, wrap around some wool. We decided for brown because it will be a bunny, but you can take any color you want. Just be creative. 
I don't think you're the ends. You can just take hot glue, but it's also easy to just tie a knot. Then we, in the next step, we decided to make a little pom pom out of that shape with that cardboard, but it turned out to be really bad. So just wrap it around your hand, like normal people do, right? It was supposed to be the head of the bunny, but now we're gonna take it as whiskers. Next step, take some cotton pads, take the wool off the inside and roll it up. So you have two little eyes and little nose for the bunny. Next part, we're going to take a cup, trim off, wrap around some wool. There you go. That will be the head of the bunny right now. Then uh, in the next step, we decide for taking a flower leaf, trim it a little so it creates the shape of the belly of the bunny. The ears are actually made of uh, the leftover from the cup. We wrap them again in the same color. Now we're going to take the eyes, uh, put on some dots with just a marker, took some styrofoam, cut it a little, and then we hot glued the top together, glued on the ears. And then, of course, to make it look more pretty, you can take the wool again and just put everything together. Great. Secure it with hot glue. Trim off the excess. Glue on the styrofoam. And on top of there, the little cotton balls. Of course, glue on the whiskers. And and the hand. Perfect. Then we decided for decorating it a little with some pearls. Again, hot glue everything in that project. Great. And the little nose. Fill it up with some bonbons or any treats you want to have in there and there you go that is our full presentation for our DIY for today this is just so cute you can take it as decoration for your room or just as presents for Easter thank you very much for watching have a nice time bye